What's going on YouTube? Up and Adam here and today we have another Madden 22 video. In today's video, we are going to be going over Season 3 and all the free cards that you can get from this new season. We're going to go through everything, so might be a little bit of a, a longer video, but you definitely want to stick around because I'm going to have some coin making methods in here as well. So before we jump into the video, make sure to hit that like button, hit that sub button, turn those noti bells on, especially if you do enjoy the content on the channel. Huge shout out to the people at MuchGG for putting together this great website and all the news that we need. So here's a preview. You can see this 99 overall uh, Pat, uh, or you want to call him M Muth? I don't know how to say his name, but you can see 99 overall and you can get this card for absolutely free. Let's go check out what the program entails. I'll show you all the cards that you can get, all the letter level up rewards, all the free coins, everything, everything you need to know. And then I'll show you how to make some coins once this program drops or once this season drops in Madden as well. Here we go, it's target to release on Thursday, February 17th. So at the time of watching the video, it should be live in game. It might be a little bit delayed depending on, they didn't tell us like what time, but it says it's targeted to go out on Thursday. Not sure exactly the time. Okay, so here it is. Everything is obviously subject to change. There is whatever they give us, right? This is just like what we were seeing on Good Morning Madden. Things can change, but here you go. We are going to be getting a few different players. So you're going to get a 96 overall Davin Cook for free. You're going to get 98 overall Nick Bolton once you complete all the levels. All right, and then you can choose either uh, Pat Firemouth or Marcus Davenport to upgrade to 99 as our Series 3 champion and your choice pack. So let's go through them. Let's talk about the players first. I want to show you the, all four players, and then you can decide which ones you want to grab. Nick Bolton, middle linebacker. This will be our level 50 reward here. So you can see all his stats. He's a middle linebacker. He's got 98 hit power, 97 tackling, 93 speed. Got some decent stats here, but it is a middle linebacker. If you don't want to use a middle linebacker, that's going to be your level 50 reward, okay? But your level, I, I got, we'll got to see what level you get this one on, but this is a free 96 overall Dalvin Cook, all right? 95 speed. It's going to be free, so this, if you have any of his power-ups or if you have any of his uh elite player items you can sell those for a good amount once people start getting to that level but you can see all his stats on the screen right here really solid for a free card and then your season champions that you can decide if you want either this card okay you can get this 99 overall hat tight end the card art looks amazing 93 speed 93 run blocking his catching is a 99 really solid card here this is a 99 version obviously you have to get all the like, you have to get like your tokens to power them up but this is what the final card will look like. And we have Marcus Davenport right here. 94 speed. Yes, this card is probably like, if you had to choose either one, I'm thinking this Marcus Davenport will be the better option. The reason why I say this card will be probably better than the tight end is just because it's a free right end. It's got that 94 speed. Power moves is a 98. 92 finesse moves. Tackling is solid. This card is, I think, is better than that Pat tight end right here. But again, it's up to you what you want to use. Now, let me show you how to get those cards and all the other rewards you get along the way from leveling up. So here are all of them. I'm not going to go through every single one of them. All right. But you can see all the rewards here. If you want to stop the video or pause the video at any point to see them, you're more than welcome to. But at level five, you'll be able to choose your season champion. You can either take the Firemouth or the Davenport and you get one season collectible where you can put in and to get them over to the next level, right? And you need to go get those from level 15, level 25, okay, level 35 and level 45 will get the max to 99. At level 30, you get this 96 overall Dalvin Cook that I showed you. It's gonna be end cat, so you can't sell it or you can't do anything like that, but you do get a free 96 overall Dalvin Cook at level 30, okay? Another one, the Nick Bolton you get at level 50, 98 overall NCAT as well at level 50. A few things that to, to take note, you got a 96 overall power pass. Okay, you got some more power passes on level 28. Uh, elite packs, strategy items, coins, and training. Lots of decent rewards here. So I, I really like the pack rewards because there's a ton of free packs you can get and the season, or sorry, and the power passes are definitely uh, much needed. Wish they were a little bit better than 96, but still not too bad with those power up passes right over there so here's the images of the season rewards obviously these can be changed it's a work in progress but at the moment these are the rewards you get for leveling up 
the main thing that we need to take we need to talk about is going to be how long it takes to level up all right so in the past it wasn't a whole lot this time around the early mutt levels will be 10 to 15,000 XP per level and then the later levels are going to be up to 25,000 XP that is quite a bit in season two you only needed 15,000 for a majority of like almost all of the levels the earlier ones were a little bit less but 15,000 was was pretty much what you needed but now it's going up to 25 25,000 per level which is quite a bit so it's going to take a long time to level up but you will have some good rewards along the way and last thing that you can get for leveling up are going to be the store offers here are all the store offers that you can get at level 5 will be two elite fantasy packs level 10 will be an elite pack some platinum players a 94 overall plus overall full legend harvest blitz and champion packs platinum cards two all pro fantasy packs and then a full ultimate legend at 45. We don't know exactly which ones are going to be for coins and which ones are going to be for points yet but i assume stuff like the the 94 plus overall full legend will be something with points the blitz offer will probably be something with points maybe coins but the full legend full ultimate legend will definitely be something with points i would assume but we will wait to see until those are in game but those are some offers if you do want to spend some money or you want to get some use some coins to buy some packs okay so there they all are okay so now is how to make coins what usually happens when we have a series changeover is we get or a season changeover sorry i should say the, the odds in packs are kind of boosted seems like the odds are way better from the previous season so i think packs will be open i think the market will come down a little bit however we are getting team builders as well probably around the same time that this, this season drops so season three once that drops i believe we're going to also be getting 64 new team builders they haven't revealed those at the time of recording the video they will reveal them later uh later in the day but those are going to require sets and they're going to be requiring pieces for that so what you can be doing once people are opening a ton of packs with the new season a lot of new odds change you can pick up some players for cheap and sell or build some of these team builders usually when we get a team affinity program the market goes up on those usually they sell for a lot more and you can make a lot of coins early on so if you're around during the day when they drop it's a good time to build and sell them or just sell the pieces that are required to build i have a feeling they're going to be probably like anywhere between like 83s to like 90s i think the team builders will probably be around 92 or 93 overall so there's gonna be some coins to be made especially once this this program drops another thing that you can do with this is just taking advantage of the market making sure you're sniping when people are opening packs because people get level rewards they get more coins they're spending a little bit more coins on packs and things like that we should also be getting some more honors cards so more people will be opening packs to be getting some ltds in terms of like the signature series lots to do in madden once this content drops in game so make sure you take advantage of all of that all right but those are the main ways that you're going to be making coins and one last thing i want to talk to you about people are going to be super interested in the team builders right they're going to be going into team builders three whatever it is right they're going to forget about sets like team diamonds they're going to forget about sets like team Di I mean, team builders two and one they're going to be forgetting about these sets that we talked about with the gridiron guardians and other cards like this so make sure you go through some of the older sets once this content drops in game because i think there's gonna be a lot of profitable sets there and we are getting ultimate legends on saturday which means that some of these cards or some of these players we had in previous in the game here are going to be getting upgrades and those cards could go up in price so i'm definitely looking at cards like randy moss i'm looking at team diamond ones who might get some upgrades so they showcase some of the numbers so i'm going in through some of the team builder team diamond one sorry and grabbing a couple of cards that i think could potentially get an upgrade here like this larry larry wilson possibly could get an upgrade so i have one in my binder already made okay another one could be bracket billy joe dupre could get an upgrade i'm not sure exactly who's going to be getting the upgrade phil sims maybe but sorry tony brackens not sorry not the other bracket sorry tony brackens could get an upgrade as well lots of cards in the team diamond one set could be profitable once they get their once their cards are announced so i'm still i'm building those lots to do to make coins i'll have another video fully on how to make coins from the team builders once it's dropped in game and we see the sets but make sure you hit those noti bells on because i will be going through the best ways to make coins 
in another, another video probably later today. So anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you get your free cards level up, get some of those really good options, and I'll catch you with another one very soon.